The stem for this question walkthrough is, an organization is planning to migrate from an on-premises data center to an AWS environment that spans multiple availability zones. A migration engineer has been tasked to plan the transfer of the home directories and other shared network attached storage from the data center to AWS. Your migration design should support connections from multiple EC2 instances running the Linux operating system to this common shared storage platform. What storage options best fit your design? As the question states, you are looking for the storage option that best fits the design. The requirements outlined in the stem are migration from on-premises to a multi-AZ AWS environment, transferring of the home directories and network attached storage, and it needs to support connections from multiple instances running a Linux OS. With those requirements set, which of the responses will be the best fit to the design? The responses available are, A, transfer the files to S3 and access that data from the EC2 instances. B, transfer the files to the EC2 instance store attached to the EC2 instances. C, transfer the files to Amazon EFS and mount that file system to the EC2 instances. And D, transfer the files to one EBS volume and mount that volume to the EC2 instances. All right, now I'll give you some time to see if you can figure out the key. I'm going to be starting again soon. If you need more time, pause now. I'll be resuming in three, two, and one. The key for this question is C, transfer the files to Amazon EFS and mount that file system to the EC2 instances. EFS is well suited to support a broad spectrum of use cases from home directories to business critical applications. It's specifically designed to provide massively parallel shared access to thousands of instances. Just in case you didn't catch this one, I'll still go through the other responses. Response A stated to transfer the files to S3 and access the data from the instances. The biggest issue with this solution is that S3 does not provide file systems such as home directories. B suggested to transfer the files to instance storage attached to the instances. If you've studied up on instance storage, you'd know that it's ephemeral. Additionally, it can only be attached to a single instance and cannot be connected or moved across multiple EC2 instances. And response D proposed that you transfer the files to one EBS volume and mount said volume to the EC2 instances. While you can attach a volume to multiple instances, Amazon EBS volumes are better designed for storage of data that requires frequent updates, such as the system drive for an instance or storage for a database application. Also, a single EBS volume cannot be mounted to multiple instances in different availability zones. As you can see, none of the other solutions met all of the requirements stated in the stem, so the key is still response C. That's it for now. Cheers.